What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Third Person. My name is Chris, and with me, as always, are my buddies Mike and Jesse. How's it going? Hey, man. Guys, we're going into the Badlands review style this time around for Episode 8, The Sting of the Scorpion's Tail. Yeah. What? Sting of the Scorpion's Tail. Hey, We're going to be reviewing this. Uh, Jesse, if no one's seen this review before, what do we do on this thing? Well... You have our story, you have our visuals, our characters and acting, our music, and our overall, followed by a group overall, all of which are rated with butterfly shurikens. Damn no. straight. Mikey, you usually start us off, so why don't you go ahead and do just the, you know, that. Just, just that, man. All right, man. I'm going to go with the story, man. <laughs> <laughs> You guys would kill me if I did it the whole way. I was right? gonna see if you were gonna do kill it. You. Hey, hey, man. He's yeah. doing. He's no, doing. No, that's I, his. That's his. Uh, Quinn impression. My, my, yeah. my Quinn from my this Quinn episode. Impression. Yeah. This impression. Veil. <laughs> mm. well, mm -hmm. Anyway, story. I will give it three point five. Only be which is my highest rating of the <sighs> of of ca each category. Only because I'm kind of glad. That Sonny and everybody is back into the Badlands. They got in, even though it was a little difficult uh, to get there. They're there, and it's cool that now Sonny knows that he is a child, and that Vale knows that Sonny's alive. That's why I gave it Word. a 3.5. Word is Bond. Um, yes. And now for my visuals, you say, I'm going to go with a three, please. <laughs> <laughs> I just see Jesse's. I know. <laughs> no. All right. So the beginning fight scene I thought was cool, um, with the sheets and the butterflies going after um, the butterflies the one, were attacking him. The butterfly kisses. They know, were butterfly the kisses right into his damn skull. Yeah. What was that Baron's name? Dick bag. Baron, I don't fucking Baron, know. Uh, ball bag. Yes. Uh, well, the like, one, the, you know, is. the one, yeah, the one Baron. So, um, it was that was a cool uh, beginning, <laughs> beginning fight, <laughs> beginning fight scene. Um, what else did I write? And the, of course, the beheading from the widow and cutting off his arm. I mean, hey, that's always cool, cool stuff, right? Um, and of course, I liked when the sun, Sunny and and the widow went back to back after Sunny changed oh, yeah, his yeah. his deal again and. Them two would be a badass tag team. That would be pretty pretty cool. Yeah. Uh, so yeah. So nothing super super extraordinary, but 3.0 for visual. For my characters, I will give it a 3.0. Also, um, I mean nothing too crazy. Uh, I wrote down actually nothing that really stuck out. But you know there was a couple scenes with Sonny. The dialogue was just horrible. Like when he was in the back of the jeep with MK, and he's like, "Hey, shut up." kid you know when mk was like oh i can't believe you're you're fucking us over and all this kind of stuff not <laughs> realizing it's so fucking naive that sonny was obviously saying whatever the hell he had to say to get them the fuck out of there yeah right um so i thought you know it was a couple of stupid little things um but i did enjoy quinn with his uh scene with lydia and vale and how he was talking about henry and how he's going to leave everything to henry and all this oh, kind yeah, of stuff yeah. Just his, just the way he thinks, Quinn, that he can just have whatever the fuck he wants, yeah, you know. A fucking douchebag. Uh, you know, but overly nothing that stuck out too, too much. But Quinn is always one of those top character kind of guys for me as far as the acting. Um, for for music, I'm giving it a three. Also, I don't usually rate music too high on this show. I mean, um, they definitely know how, and I mentioned this several times in other reviews that they they know how to uh, they know how to um, to place the you know the, the the right music at the right time, especially with their fight scenes and and um, uh, their the sound effects of the weapons and all this kind of stuff. And sometimes they do it a little over, like a little little too much. I think Chris mentions that a lot with the sound effects from these weapons, but. <laughs> Uh, it's it's still cool. It's entertaining. Yeah. There was one thing that I did write down though. It was um, it was kind of that build up music, uh, background music when um, Lydia was performing the ceremony and uh, they had to cut each other's hands, Vale and, and and Quinn, and there was kind of that build up like we weren't sure what Vale was gonna do. Was she gonna grab the knife? Was she gonna you know because she kind of had the knife up high, like she was gonna 
you know, stab Quinn fast, and they kind of yeah. built that music up a little bit, and then obviously she doesn't. Um, but I thought that was, you know, probably the best part as far as what stuck out to me with the music and stuff. So overall, it's like a three point two five. I have one point five, so I don't know how you'd calculate that. So I'm gonna just give it a three. Um, nothing crazy, but like I said, I'm kind of excited that now Vale and Sonny know each other's alive and that's, you know, and, uh, he's going to be fucking coming after, coming after Vale. So we'll see what happens. These next couple should be, should be real good. They better be. I'll tell you that yeah. much. Um, all right. So, uh, I'll give you mine uh, real quick story. I'm going to give it 3.5. Uh, like Mike said, I mean, Mike, Mike pretty much covered everything. I feel pretty much the same way. There were some really cool little twists in here. You got the classic. Oh, I'm gonna, I'm, I'm attempt, I'm gonna look like I'm turning bad, but I'm not. And yeah, uh, Baggy's like, ah, he turned bad. Oh wait, no, he's not. And MK doesn't know what's going on ever at all times. And I thought that was fun. So yeah, you got the cool little that little trope in there. That was fun. Uh, Sunny back as a regent. Like there were some cool things. Like you said, uh, the fight. The I'm uh, not the fight. The uh, at the end when uh, him and. Sunny and Minerva get together, you know, yeah. simply because she's like, I know where your kids are. I know, I know where your kid and your wife are, yeah. or whatever. Your, your lady. Um, to the, the the Quinn stuff is like, oh my god, it's so over the top, but still kind of cool. Uh, yeah, like he just thinks he can do whatever. Anyway, three point five. We'll talk more about it in the discussion, but yeah. So story was, you know, not great, but there were some really cool elements to it. Visuals, I gave it a three point five. Uh, nothing too excruciatingly awesome this time. There was some. Some cool stuff, like you said in the beginning. Some of the some of the fights, uh, portions of, of random fights were cool. Nothing nothing that crazy. I usually give it at least a three point five because by default, really, they, they they do some cool shit on the show on yeah. TV. So uh, characters, I'm giving it a three. And that's pretty low for me. Even with Quinn, Quinn's really getting over the top. His haircut changes every time. His acts, he's getting more and more like. Mississippi pimp. Yeah, he's getting Mississippi pimp, and it's like, all right, <laughs> you know, again, you know, he did good though. Um, like you said, some of the dialogue was a little cheesy. They they love to write cheesy shit. I don't know why, but they do. Uh, so yeah, so whatever. It was a three. Music, I'm giving it also a three. Same thing. Nothing crazy. Uh, I did notice that build up, like you said, Mike. Uh, and you know, again, if I don't notice it, if it doesn't ring out to me, then it 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 doesn't get a higher score than that for yeah. me. Yeah. But you hear it, you know it, it undertones everything. So and they, and again the sound effects. There was one sound effect where he all he does is he 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 twists the sword at Minerva's neck. The yeah. And, neck. He, and it was like swing, yeah. and I'm like, no, no, that's not you gonna do. the little rings on the end of it. It wasn't the ring noise. It was a swing. It wasn't a tingle, 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 tangle. It wasn't that. Because we've gotten jingle, jingle. It wasn't jingle, jangle. Uh-huh. It was as if he was like, Wah! or some shit, you know? Whoa. That would have even been better. Anyway, so um, overall for me, I'm, I'm, it's it's a little low for me. It's a three. <laughs> All right. Well, I, yeah, I hate to do it. <laughs> I hate to do it. Story three. Uh, Certain parts lost me, but I thoroughly enjoyed Baji, Sunny, and MK. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The rest of it, not so much. I mean, it has some cool turns, you know. Eh. I didn't eh. see Sonny going with with uh, the widow. Eh. <laughs> yeah. All right. Eh. Go ahead. Yeah. That, that that's my story. Eh. Eh. Right. Visuals. Three point five. Some good visuals. Not so good choreography. Yeah. Some of that nah. was ass. Nah. Some of that was butt. Yeah. Specifically, Tilda when she starts the fight at the end. She she's like going to parry before the guy is even there. She's like, oh, 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 oh. and then the guy finally swings a sword. Yeah, that not, was like not good. that was like like the the second or third episode where the the spear went into the guy and the guy moved back before the spear got to him. And the and that was the, the first episode, I think, was that the first one? And the spear yeah. had no no spearhead on it. It was just a flat yeah. pole. <laughs> All right. So characters and acting. Hate to do it. It's a three. Very mm-hmm. fast and loose with the acting this time around. Mm-hmm. I did not enjoy it. Fast and loose. Yeah, I, it was. It was not like good a whore at all. <laughs> like yeah, okay, there were some decent parts. But, uh, yeah, everyone was God. a little off this time. I got you, man. Music. Two point five. 
<laughs> that is the lowest music rating I've given. Yeah, man. Not really noticeable. Nothing really stood out except for the buildup. Yeah. Nothing. True, There's true. Just nothing. My overall is a flat three. Nothing hey. stood out. Uh, Not uh, very uh, episode. You, you're crazy, man. So, so that's going to put this entire episode... Out of three? Out of three. Too yeah. bad. Yeah. Um, yeah. Man, I don't know. Fuck. I mean, again, it's not horrible. <sighs> No, nah, not horrible. They middle of the not. road. Middle of, middle of, the, of road. the road. Yeah. Middle I know. I know. We had fun watching it. If you, you could see that in the live reaction. I but... mean, the only way you could get music lower than a two point five for me is if it's unnecessarily loud at parts and or, if or it's all like, all trance unfitting. If it was yeah. all trance. Um. All right. So yeah, three guys. I mean, you know, it's a shame because I really, I like where the story's going. I mean, I really do. I like. Yeah, it I like started where it's off going. This episode. It's just the intricacies of the story, like how people. I don't know, whatever. But they're still great. We still love the show. Don't don't get us wrong. Yeah. I kind of um, got annoyed with Quinn this time around too, with yeah, his too. you know accent. Yeah, I kind of hey, did too. Sunny's alive. I actually There's enjoyed Sunny, Sunny a alive. lot in this episode. To be honest with you, he had some dumb <laughs> yes. lines, but I actually really enjoyed. Uh, Sunny, I really like Sunny. Anyway, we'll you know we'll get into that later. Um, sorry, so that's gonna do it for us over here of this time around for the review for Badlands. Mikey, where can people find us if they so choose? Well, people can so choose to find us on YouTube, of course, at Third Person Pod. We love the little comments and everything down below in the uh, comment box. So write some stuff in there. That would be cool. Uh, yeah. They can find us at iTunes, of course, at Third Person. Write your reviews in there as well. Let us know that you're listening um, on that vessel to hear us. Ooh. And, uh, of course, the Instagram. Check out what we post. We're always posting when we put up new videos. Sometimes we'll put up some cool stuff for you guys to uh, enjoy and look at. Imagine. And, uh, of course, uh, don't forget about Mrs. Old, Mr. Mrs. Facebook, whichever you'd like to, uh, whichever gender you choose. Check. So uh, check us out at Third Person Pod there also. And, uh Leave us comments and everything below there as well. Damn right. Uh, also, don't forget to go check out the review and the discussion for this particular episode. Uh, I'm sorry, the live reaction in the discussion for this particular episode because you're watching the review, and I and we thank you for that. So hey, uh, man. yeah. So you're yeah, crazy. go check those out. Yeah, and uh, as always, Comic Blitz right down there below me. You know, ComicBlitz.com. Why do you say third blow? Per- <laughs> God dang it, Mike. <laughs> Blow me. This guy's a dirty right dog, man. Below, you know, you guys, are, you know, as always, as always, you can blow me. And uh... <laughs> this guy's a pig. Anyways, comicalblitz.com, third person pod, three months, three bucks. It's a buck a month. Go and there you it. go. Go and do it. Um, also, guys, as you can see, I got a new graphic up there for Retro Squat. If you go to at Retro Squat, you can follow that or retrosquat.com it's a uh, it's another podcast that i do with another friend of mine uh where we just take um properties like movies tvs cartoons and video games from the 80s and we randomly choose two and we mash them together and try and come up with something interesting and fun and, and cool and funny uh with those things so go check that out retrosquat.com is the easiest place to get that or you can follow us at retro squat that's it thank you guys so much we appreciate all the watchings and the and the and the typings of the words to us and everything like that. You guys are awesome and uh, yeah. So we will see you on the next review for Into the Badlands. Thanks, guys. Tita dance. No, it worked. <laughs> swing. Good. That was a that was a real swing. That was a good one. That man. was a real yeah. swing. <laughs>